Hello everybody, I am back again today. I'm gonna to open up another box of this Marvel Metal Universe um, Upper Deck 2020 product, um, technically 2021. Um, last box I opened, I only had a couple of hits of Palladium, um, Psych, and a Copper Cyclops. Um, about, I don't know, 30, 40% of a low base set to the low number to 100. Um, I do like this product, um, however, one of the annoying things with this product is the fact that it's really, really hard to tell what a, um, a gold parallel is versus a base. And I don't have my handy dandy knife, so I apologize for that. Um, but we'll get in here. Hopefully, what happens is this, uh... Helps me get a majority, if not the rest, of the cards for my uh, low base set. And maybe maybe I get lucky and I pull another uh, decent pull. But we will see. So, um, haven't been opening a lot of product. I've been busy with lots of things. But, you know, such as the way things happen. So, Sabretooth, Multiple Man, Jubilee, Magneto. See, that looks like a gold parallel of Namor. Uh, and see, one of the upper levels. And then Firestar. So, anything above 100 is kind of that second tier, that alternate art. Those kinds of, uh, those kinds of cards. Elixir, Strife, Thunderbird, Deathbird, Blink, Colossus. I think this Blink might be the gold Blink, but uh, I haven't really looked at a lot to see how that works. So I still have some, some older cards to open eventually. I have the time. I got some boxes of the Marvel Annual and uh, some of the Through the Ages cards. Uh, Brew, Dazzler, Sunfire, Gateway, Lilandra, Polaris. A couple of X Men in there. Brew from Jason Aaron's, I think, criminally underrated. Uh, series. Wolverine and the X-Men. Um, pretty fun overall series. Juggernaut, X-23, Silver Samurai, Richter, a Shatter Star armor, and this is one of those um, grandiose cards. It's going to get that black, per, excuse me, purple sparkly background. So definitely going to do that. Nimrod, Sunspot, Gambit, Lalandra. Oh, a Palladium Colossus. There's a boom, boom. So that's one hit. It's not a bad hit. Well, I'm a big fan of Colossus. I remember being a kid and watching him side with Magneto, reading the comic books after Fatal Attractions, kind of just blew my mind. Always a big, always a big um, Colossus fan, Excalibur fan. Another Firestar, Colossus, Polaris, Blindfold, Toad. Only one hit through about half of it. So the hit rate for this I'm not going to lie, I think it's pretty terrible. Not a lot of inserts and a lot of insets. But still. Oh, wow. Okay, that's that's one. Comic cut. Now these. That's a pretty nice one. X-Men number 10s. X-Men 105.
41 out of 43. That's, okay, that's cool. That's a cool hit. I've pulled one of those before. I've, I've pulled a comic cut before. Those are, those are super fun, super nice. Sage again. Dark Phoenix, is this Cyclops Dark Phoenix? Yeah. Havoc, Onslaught, Jean Grey Dark Phoenix, Havoc. So it's a 173. It's a 73, so I bet it's the high, quote unquote, alternate version of it. The Avengers versus X-Men crossover. Cypher, Copycat, Iceman, Aurora, Onslaught looks to be the gold parallel. Another Cypher. So it's nice. You can see kind of the back, kind of how that's the low set back look. That's the high set back look. So, right now, only two hits, and that might be it for the box. It's about my hit rate. In the last box, Kid Omega, Deadpool, Bedlam, another copycat. It looks like I'm hitting the the lows and highs of some characters, which is kind of fun. Copycat I always enjoyed. Um, she's been dead for a while in the comics as far as I know. But you already had one blue shapeshifter who you didn't need a second one. Mystique, Cyclops, well, Emma Frost, Blink, Legion, Aurora, and Proteus. So feeling pretty good that I might have put together my, my base. Cannonball and his classic look, Warpath. Banshee, the Stepford Cuckoos, Legion, and Kid Omega. So this Legion, this has got to be the gold Legion, right? You look at that. So when you have the base, you can kind of find that golden one, but sometimes it's like super, super hard to tell. But this is our comic cut. Zoom in a little bit on it. Cool looking card. Still think it's sacrilege to cut up a comic book like that, but that's damn cool. And especially, it looks like it's probably Jean, which is awesome. All right, well, thanks for coming along on this journey with me. Um, only the requisite two pulls a box. Uh, overall, eh, not my favorite product, but I still enjoyed it. Uh, it was fun opening these couple of boxes. Uh, but until next time, I have been Josh.